Uh, hi guys, uh, well, I'm Ina Gavrilenko and here's my channel where I share all my discoveries about myself, the world, uh, from different people that I listen to, follow and read and, and watch and some information is there, some information is mine but inspired by other people and I think that's how it is. Uh, people who know more share the information and people who know less listen to that information and after create their own way of sharing information. And um, here I am in this uh, little hotel, little cute boutique hotel in Philippines in Bohol and uh, I just felt like it's time for me to stop being scared and fearful and do what I want. And what I want is to share the information that I know with the rest of you. So there was this girl who I asked uh, what I need to do in order to become myself. And she said that I have to do what I like. And I really knew that I like doing th these things. I like talking deep, having nice conversation, long hours conversations, and I really love sharing it with other people. And um, maybe they will learn something from me. And uh, she said that I need to do something I love and I'm not supposed to be afraid because as I understood also that the more you're afraid of doing something, that's something that you have to do because we are always afraid before we succeed. Uh, I don't know why, but often it's like this when we want to do something and just before it's really there, before we just get, get it or catch it or feel it in our hands, that's the time we are really back out. And I created this channel over a year ago and it was... It was very difficult. It was very exciting at the beginning because I just did it for fun. But after I got a little bit serious about this, it was very difficult for me to, to actually fight my fear and do what, I, what I'm doing now. And she said that, you know, the information uh, of each person creates like ripple effects. So you're here. You're sharing information and as if you were throwing stone in the water. Just throw a stone and it creates the circles. And one circle creates another and it just goes like this in waves. And that's how I feel the information goes around me. And uh, maybe you listen to this information and you will be a better person tomorrow than you are today. Um, and it's very interesting uh, intro because uh, the video I want to do now is about comfort zone. So just a second. So here it is and I hit it with everything. So for me comfort zone is uh, this tiny tiny human being over there and the round thing around it is the comfort zone. So when we are being born uh, I believe our comfort zone is all we have in our apartment, right? First it's our, uh, our bed, then it's our house, then we go to kindergarten, it's our friends, then we go to school, it's our school, and the more we learn things, the more our comfort zone expands. But we don't really understand and notice this because we just go with life, we're not aware of anything. But then, once we become aware, uh, the fear kicks in and we're not going out much or we're not going out of our comfortable space our this uh, sleeping zone our, uh, from our couch from our apartment especially right now at this time of uh, pandemic of uh, i'm not supposed to say maybe the words um yeah oh in this uh, 2021 a difficult time people are just becoming lazy more and more and uh, don't really want to do anything and uh, it's either out of fear or out of laziness right but all these feelings come out of fear i believe that fear is really the base of all that so what it was very difficult for me at first also to do videos and uh, speak my truth speak what i say now 
Uh, it was fe I was feeling very awkward, even though I'm a model and I'm used to being in front of the camera. Uh, it's completely different to become a blogger, vlogger or whatever and uh, speak just like that. And especially sharing something from your heart, being very vulnerable in that moment. So for me, comfort zone is like this. Whatever you are in your life, there is you. And there are things that you touch around. That may be your city, that may be your country. Maybe more, maybe less. Might be your books that you're reading, your social network, the gym that you go to or the sports that you do, the food. And you don't really take anything more out of this experience that you already have. You don't like to do anything because you just feel like it's enough and it's okay. But what happens there? you don't grow you're just here and you feel comfortable and nothing is going to happen no miracles no new friends you're just not in charge of, in, of your destiny you're not in charge of your life you're just there living it and every day is the same every day is like previous and if you feel that something something is not right that you're just you just want more to that that's the time you should start having it there. You, you, that's the time you start learning. Start doing something new. So these dots are your new things that you try in your life. You never tried, let's say, Thai food. You go into a restaurant and you, tie, you try Thai food. You never went to an expensive restaurant. You go and you take, uh, you take your friend if you're not comfortable. And you go to an expensive restaurant that you never went to before. And like this, by learning little new things, trying little new things, try on a new sport, a new habit. Uh, well, habits are difficult, but still, why not? Maybe you're strong enough to take on a new habit. Try to read new books, watch different types of movies or listen to different type of music. I don't know, do something crazy that you didn't, you, you're not used to do or you would never do. And that will make you go a little bit out of your comfort zone little bit more here there everywhere and it will create you of the next level you will be stronger more confident and your comfort zone will expand then maybe you're traveling i don't know do something travel in different places that you never traveled to talk to different people talk to different nationalities and uh, that will build you up so instead of being small and don't really feel yourself you will become stronger you will become more confident and then once you're getting used to this once you're getting used to one once your comfort zone becomes bigger you're getting more you're going to learn something new you're learning new things you pick up picking up new habits new hobbies you're reading different books, you're watching to different people, you're learning new information. And for me, it was, uh, I've, I have never left my city, my hometown, until the age of 15. And then when I went for modeling classes, at the age of 18, I went to Turkey from Ukraine. I was, uh, I'm Ukrainian, I was living in Ukraine. So... I left to Turkey for my uh, first trip abroad. Oh my God, it was, <laughs> it was really like that. It was like, wow, the world is really bigger than just my little hometown of one million people. And then I started talking new, to new people. The life brought me there. And then the life brought me to modeling school. And Hello. sorry. Oh, sorry, I got a little interruption. Yes, so I went to modeling school and then after I was traveling abroad, so my comfort zone became wider and wider. And as I learned new skills, as I talked to different people, as I met new different cultures. So this is really how I see the comfort zone and how I see the circle of life. So it really makes you stronger. It makes you, you know, um, you, you don't look at yourself small anymore. You become bigger and bigger and uh, you become more confident uh, i have no idea if there are any any time stop to this if you can be 
at one time strong and uh, know all they're possible to know or be confident enough that you don't have fear of doing anything anymore. But what I know is that I still have uh, certain things to do. I still have uh, different uh, ways of doing things, discovering myself or widening my comfort zone. And uh, maybe it's never ending process, but maybe it is. Uh, I'm still in my journey to find it out. So I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, you can give it a like. Uh, you can share comments in your comments what you think about this, uh, how much you think your comfort zone is and how big, how wide, how strong you are, how confident you are to do new things, uh, to learn new skills. And I will read all of them and maybe we can, have, can even have a discussion about it. So thank you very much. Uh, follow, subscribe and I'll see you next time.